Okay, there's the job I'm working on. I'm redoing this six stringer which naffed up on me on the last one. Okay. So basically it's gonna go in there. We're gonna have the brace right the way through and I've got another two inches that I can brace this neck with into there. That should be more than enough to do the job. Okay, what I've got here, right there, I've got a little mark there, you probably just about see it, which is the centre of the neck. Okay, I've got a mark at the back end there which is the centre of the neck. I've got a piece of wood which is going to go on there and that's got a centre mark there. I've already, as you can see, I've cut the piece out there okay there's your centre mark running right through and what I'm going to do then I'm going to place this over the top so obviously that needs a, a cut out as well going to go in there that's going to fit nicely on there and then we want the uh, the tin plate cutting as well so I've got my center line there my center line there is all married up now to get the center line on the tin plate I want to do that obviously but I want it to get it absolutely spot on so what I've done on this piece of paper I've marked round this on the paper okay um, just for argument's sake I pretend to do it again so I marked all the way around here, round there, round there, round there, round there. I put a centre line that corresponds with the centre line on the backing piece of wood and a centre line there. Okay, I've got my shape in there now on the paper. I've run my centre line off the paper from that, that position that position and right down through where the cut is. I checked everything, centre, centre, centre. There's a bit of adjustment here where some of the wood needs to be shaved off. So I'm working on these end bits there as being 45 degrees 